So today this is the Mac cutter and I will show you how to use it. For extra safety, keep your hand at the top of the handle. I will show you how to secure the Mac cutter to put your sheet in. Very simple, you lift the handle completely. When it's done, you just have to pull the blade a little bit. When it's on the good side, you can lock there. Right now, you can pass your hand under it without any problem and without any safety issue. So the best way to use the Mac cutter is have a nice table, the length of your siding with two by four screw for support and one to be sure you are straight with your cutter. So next, I will show you how to place the plank inside the cutter. Secure the Mac cutter to put your sheet in. So right now, I will show you which part go where to have a perfect cut. So you got the male part just over there, go inside the male part to cut, and you got the female part that just sit there. So basically, you just have to insert the sheet, and when it's done, the male part go nowhere. I can try lifting it, it will not go. Make sure the male part is correctly inserted. Be sure it's support on both sides to make a perfect cut. To be sure your panel is square with your cutter, you either put a 2x4 or use a square. So when it's done, you slide your panel till your measurement and you just have to unlock the cutter and cut the panel all the way through. After every cut, be sure to lock the Mac cutter. When the cut is done, two things left to do. The first thing to do is rip up the flange with the pry bar. The second part is flip the panel, take your snip, Cut the flange. Now your panel is cut and ready to be installed. 